Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a different type of video. I'm going to show you how I apply my hair extensions and you could just see like my before and after. So I have this video in collaboration with Foxy Locks. They wanted to do a video with me and I don't do like hair tutorials really often. So I think this is a cool opportunity. So here you can see my hair before and this is after the extensions. It's really nice, big and voluminous. So this is how the back looks when you um, purchase them. It comes with a sample and it comes with a bundle of the hair extensions that you buy. And this is how the stroke looks. It's really long and nice. So it comes with different uh, sizes of strokes. This one has four clips. This one has three clips. And they also have one with two clips and one with one clip. And I will put in the description like how much you get from the four clips. And so you can just see how much you will get. So the first thing I do is brush my hair. And I do have to say, I'm not a professional. I don't wear extensions really often. So in this video, you can clearly see that I'm doing maybe something's wrong, but I will tell you what I'm doing wrong so you can learn from it and I can learn from it next time. Um, it was just really hard because I was standing before my background and I had no mirror. I really didn't know how to see what I was doing. So it isn't perfect, but hopefully you will get like the point of how you can do it. So I'm first going to section my hair, hair, hair. I'm going to section my hair and put it in a bun, like right uh, below my ear. And you can see that like the hairline isn't really straight. So try to make this as straight as possible because mine wasn't straight at all. I feel kind of embarrassed, but as long as you put the clips in straight, I don't think this is like a huge problem because at the end of the video, you will see that you won't see anything back from it anymore but I think the straighter you start, the more perfect it will be. So I'm going to start with this four section hair piece, which has four clips. Before you apply them, make sure that the clips are open. So once you put the hair piece in front of your hair, you can just press the hair strokes and the clips will automatically close and stick to your hair. So I feel like I might should have applied the hair stroke a little bit lower so I can do my second one at the place I have it right now. But it's not a huge problem because I don't have a lot of volume at the upper part of my head. So this way I will create a bit more volume, more higher, if that makes sense. So now I'm going to create my second section. And I'm doing exactly the same thing, but I'm just sectioning my hair a bit higher so I can apply my second stroke. And yeah, it's quite easy. Just make sure that you brush your hair in between and all you need is a pair of extensions, a hair brusher and some elastic bands and then you're good to go, I guess. So I'm putting a bun in again, just like I did the first time. And again, my hairline isn't straight, so annoying, but yeah. I'm not a professional. <laughs> uh, maybe I need to stick it with eyeshadow. I don't know. But yeah. So I'm going to apply the second um, stroke of four clips. The packaging came with two pieces of this stroke, which is like very wide, which I believe is meant for like how I'm doing it, that you start with these and apply them um, around the ear area. So now I'm going to show you how I apply the two clip extension stroke. So I'm going to put a bun up a bit higher and I want these strokes to be more at my face area. So I get a little bit more volume over there. My hair is so straight naturally that sometimes it just looks really flat and it just looks flat, I guess. So I'm going to put a bun in and you can do this as high as you want. You can do it even higher. But this is just the way I always do it and I just want to show you the way I do it. So I'm going to take the two clip in stroke and apply this right behind my ear. And the reason why I'm doing it behind my ear is because sometimes I just don't like to have all that hair in my face and I like to put my hair behind my ear. And I noticed that when I apply the clip right after my ear, you won't see the clips. Uh, when I'm doing that so that's nice and if you would like place the clips a bit more towards your eye area so like straight um, 
just more towards your face then you will see the clip once you pull your hair after your ear so this is just a small technique or trick that i found out by just trying different things so now that i have my clips in i'm going to brush my hair the kit comes obviously with way more clips but i feel like this is enough volume for me if you have even more thinner hair of course you can apply more clips i think this is totally like how you would like to have it but this is how i feel like it looks best on me and more natural so this was the before and here you can see the end result i think it's a huge difference i think it looks so pretty and the color of the extensions blend really nice with my hair it feels so soft and natural so i'm really happy with these and i will definitely use them more often so let me know in the comments if you want to see like curling routines um let me know in the comments i would love to do more hair tutorials even though i'm not really good at it but i think it's just cool to switch things up but yeah let me know in the comments and i would love to see you in my next video bye guys